Hello guys, today I'll show you uh, how to change cameras in Unity in G3D. So I'll, I'll show you my script and it's really easy to make. So there. Like when I play the game now, I'll show you what I mean. So I have my game. So if I press 2, you see the camera changes. So if I put 1, so I press 1, it goes back normal so I'll go I'll show you how to do that that's really simple yeah so first of all I'll open a new scene or just something like this and I'll find one of the things and for now I'll delete those and for now, like uh, you should approximately have this. You need to have the main camera here, or some uh, the only camera, and there you see that there is script camera script attached here. So I'm going to show it to you and how to write it. So wait. So there it is. Um, I'm not going to rewrite. I'm just going to explain to you how this works. So. In here, on the top, wait. here on top you have three cameras, so it's camera one, camera two, camera three. So, and then there is function start. So when the game starts, you have three cameras and the first one is abled and the other two are enabled. Then the, there comes a function update. If you input, so you press the key you know, two, then the camera one is enabled. The camera two is is enabled, and the uh, camera three is also enabled. When you press three button three, then the first two don't work, and the the, uh, the third one will work. And if you press the button three, I mean one, sorry, then the first one works again, and other one won't. So that's really simple script, and don't worry, I'll paste it in description, so you can easily copy it. Now I will show you how to attach it to the game. So first of all, you need to duplicate this camera. So duplicate. I'll rename it to main camera two. And duplicate one more time. And call it main camera three. So main camera two. Uh, you don't need this, so remove component. remove components. So now you have three cameras and in the first one you need to attach the script here. You need to put the script in there in the first camera. So then here you have three cameras and you need to put on camera one you have the main camera one. For camera two you need to drag main camera two for camera two and the third camera three for three. Now you need to adjust them so like main camera two you can uh, also, you also have the thing called smooth follow script, and you can make a distance not 12, but you can make it like 20. The height to 15. Yeah, now that should work. In main camera 3, it also had a smooth follow. And um, I'm going to delete this one, I'm going to do something else. So, remove component, and I'll do something else. I'll make smooth smooth look at yeah so now it's like a bit different smooth like a target so it's like my car one and yeah and I'm going to put this camera uh, I'm going to put it in the corner of my scene so I'm going to put it here So now that should work. So if, let's hit play and see what happens. Yeah, so here we play, there we move, we shoot everything. Now, if I press 2, it changes. And when I press 3, the camera goes there. And you can see it going everywhere, it's nice. And now when I press 1, it comes back. So it's really simple, really nice. It's fun to play with it. and. So, 
I'm going to stop the video now and have fun. Leave me some comments. You can add me as a friend. Subscribe for me or oh sorry. And just have fun. And try not to leave any bad comments, guys. Okay, I hope you enjoyed this tutorial and uh, see you next week. Bye, guys.